Hello everyone, this is an update of my first week with the insulin pump. So how is it going you may ask? Well, wonderful. I'm actually shocked how much my sugar has dropped and is more in range than before. I'll add a little screenshot of my readings because with the AccuCheck pump I've got you get like a little thingamabobby. It's called the Smart Picks. And that you can link your meter and your pump to it. And you can download everything. And then you can email all your readings, all your settings that change or anything. You can email to your endo and guess what? They don't still have to download your whole pump when you get there. So that makes it better because you spend less time there. Hmm. Well, I actually did that twice in the week because my sugars have been incredibly high in the morning and then in the afternoon it will be quite low. So I sent it to my endo and they did a little adjustments. Then they just send you the settings and you go into your little pump thingy and click click and it's done. And it's actually pretty easy to set it. So that I have to say, the pump is really easy to use. I was actually kind of stressed to think, oh, it's so much to learn and I'm not one for learning. Well, in further videos, I'll show you what all you get with the pump and show you how to use them. Maybe I'll even do a video how I changed my set. But there are so many videos out there where people show how to do it. And they're more expert than me. I've only had mine for a week, so I might still mess up. And yes, I still get the occasional bubble in my pump. Oops. But I'll figure that out. And I will master it. I hope. And now back to that carp book I got. It's actually really helpful. Things that I thought is 20 carbs is actually 21. So you can't always go on feeling. An occasional look in a book works. Oh, that's a good saying. An occasional look in a book. Hmm. So now I'll add that little screenshot of my readings. And most of them are in range. Where before it looked like skyscrapers. One's here, one's there, one's there, one's there. They're not perfect yet, but they're getting there. Well, I'm not sure if anyone else that's got the AccuCheck pump, if they've noticed this. But I've noticed this quite a few times. When my sugar is low, like really low, it'll tell me, Caution, low, obviously. And then it'll say, take approximately 10, 12 carbs to bring it up to a suitable level. So it even tells me how many carbs I need to take when my sugar's low, which is kind of impressive. And when it's high, it works out the correction and it'll inject whatever I need to bring it down to a suitable level. And that's actually quite impressive. So how has my first week been with the pump? Well, let's start at the first night. Uh, it was hard. Because now you've got to sleep with this thing next to you. Or on you. Or wherever you decide to put it. But uh, it's a bit hard. Because now you're stressing. Well, I was. What if I roll on it? What if I lay on it? What if I bend the tubing? Well... Nothing to fear, it's actually easy. And you get really, really comfortable with it and you hardly notice it. Ask me, I've accidentally nearly ripped it out twice. Oops. Well everyone, that's all I've got for this week. But in the weeks to come, I will go in depth with the pump. My pump, crypto. And I will show everyone everything you get with it and how they work and actually i must say this pump is incredibly easy to use 
then from me, myself, and I, and crypto. Goodbye, everyone. And now a shout out. And this is for Christina Johnson. You sent me that picture of the Superman toy. <clears throat> I mean, action figure. And I really enjoyed seeing it. Maybe I can get one somewhere. Hmm.